Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365 and with Avengers Endgame right around the corner, here are the top five moments that I would like to see in the film. If you're new to the channel, please hit the like button, subscribe, hit that bell notification. I put out videos daily. You can also find me over Twitter and Instagram at MovieGuy365. Okay, so we are getting very, very close to Avengers Endgame. We're under two weeks now. So... Of course, everybody's imagination is just swirling about what we're going to see on screen. And if you're a longtime comic book reader and know the storyline, I'm sure you have a list of your own of moments that you would love to see in Avengers Endgame. Uh, they could be related to anything from like the Infinity Gauntlet, Infinity Wars, uh, you know, Infinity Crusade, those kind of things. I think we're going to get maybe a little bit of, you know, just all this stuff, you know, thrown in. But I... I don't know. I there are certain moments in since the Marvel Cinematic Universe began that I would just love to see on screen in general, and this seems like the perfect movie to to put those moments in the film. So here are my top five uh, list of things that I would like to see in in Endgame as far as like just good moments. Like these are water cooler moments kind of thing. I think we're going to definitely see a couple of them on the list. Uh, usually the the there's a, there's a few that are just a little like pie in the sky, but I would still like to see them anyway. So let's start out with my number five, and that is the end credits scene. Now, I don't, I'm not going to say, hey, any of this is a spoiler. I don't know what's happening in the film, but I can tell you something, some stuff that I would love to see in the end credits scene. Um, I, because of the whole Disney Fox thing, this is going to open up a whole new Marvel universe for us in the, in the very, very far future. But I want to see stuff laid out now. And while I think this is probably unlikely that we're going to get it, I would love to see either an appearance by Doctor Doom or Galactus. Um, I could see a Galactus appearance, honestly. I could see something like that happening, even if it's a very obscure reference, that kind of thing. But I would love to see... I, I, would, I would say that the, the end credit scene is going to have to set up the next big bad. I think that just has to happen. It's just something that, you know... I don't think the next five years of Marvel movies or the next phase is going to just be standalones. They're going to be working towards something. So you need to set up a big bat or you need to have something in the, waiting in the wings. And I chose Doom because Doom is one of my favorite quote unquote human villains in the Marvel Universe. And, you know, with, with Fox being acquired by Disney, a Fantastic Four movie is going to be happening at some point. So that's definitely realistic. But then you don't get much bigger, literally, than Galactus. And, you know, I, I would, something I, I would just love to see. I would love to see that, you know, being referenced in some way. Um, all right, so my number four is a little bit related to my number five. And in, in the comic Infinity Gauntlet, after the heroes attack and fall to Thanos, next steps up the cosmic beings. Eternity, Living Tribunal shows up, uh, you know, Kronos, uh, just, you know, Lord Chaos and Master Order. I mean, all the cosmic beings get together and try to take him down. I don't think we're going to see this because they haven't really been set up in any meaningful way. I know Eternity was referenced once or twice in the movies prior, but I don't think enough people are going to know. And it would just be kind of an out of nowhere thing for them to show up. I'm not saying it won't happen. I'm just saying, I think out of all the things on my list, this is probably the least likely to, to occur. But wow, how amazing would that look? Just Thanos with the gauntlet, taking on the beings. Uh, but yeah, I don't think it's really going to happen, but I'd love to see it if it did. Um, my number three, I think 100% is going to happen. I, I'm confident in this. I just, it was a great moment in the, in the comics, but I think it's going to turn out differently. I don't think it's going to be what we think. And that is Nebula stealing the Infinity Gauntlet. I think it's going to happen. I really do. It, the, the, the story is there. It, it, in the comics, she, she takes, when, when Thanos ascends into a godhood, he leaves his body, you know, because of the, the, gauntlet, the power of the gauntlet and the cosmic beings he just defeated, and ascends into godhood. That leaves his body literally unprotected. So she just comes up, swipe, and, but while I don't think it's going to be like that, I see her taking the gauntlet at some point. I don't know if she's going to be the one to end the conflict, but something is going to happen, and I, I see her putting it on. I think it would be cool, honestly. I, you know, I love Karen Gillan, and, you know, 
I I just love seeing her in these in this role, you know, through uh, since Guardians one. But I see I, I definitely think that's going to happen. Uh, my number two is I think on everybody's list, as is probably my number one, and that is Avengers Assemble. I one hundred percent believe that we're going to get that splash page moment where it's Thanos with the gauntlet and all the heroes come at him. And I mean all the heroes. I think somehow it's going to get... The, the heroes will come back. Everything will be reversed. Or not everything. I don't want to see the snap necessarily reversed. But I, I want to see all the heroes, both known and maybe not, you know, not so well known. Just on one, on the screen at the same time, take, you know, take them I want to hear the words. I want to hear Avengers Assemble. I, I, I'm hoping we get that. I'm, I'm very confident that it's going to happen. But, uh, and also my number one... Cap lifting Thor's hammer, Mjolnir. Yeah, it's got to happen, right? Um, yes, Thor currently does not have it because it was destroyed by Hela in Thor Ragnarok. But time travel is apparently going to be involved. You know, the the the, the trailers and the, the uh, little TV spots and the things we've heard. Yeah, I think it's going to play a factor. I think I think Thor's hammer, original hammer is going to be making a comeback. And I see Cap lifting it at some point. You know... The when and the how and the who, that kind of thing, we all don't know. But I really believe 100% that's going to happen. I would just love to see it on screen. You know, that we got teased it in Age of Ultron. Uh, there are theories out there of why he wasn't able to lift that at that time. Uh, and, you know, but come on, how epic. I These are all epic moments I would just absolutely love to see on Avengers Endgame. So leave in the comments below, what would you like to see what is your epic moments you would love to see in Avengers Endgame? Let me know in the comments. And in the meantime, please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification. I put out videos every single day. So until next time, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.